Welcome back. The San Diego Humane Society's Virtual Walk for Animals Week continues today. Casey McKinnon joins us from Moreno with details on how you can take part. And she has a special friend and a toy. Who is this one, Casey? <laughs> this is a good boy. This is Chaco, and he came in as a stray, but he is just the sweetest dog, and someone trained him very, very well. He just kind of wants to be by you, and snuggle so we're having a good time over here he likes the camera that's always a great sign um, and I have Nina Thompson with us this morning because we're gonna be talking about two things and first I want to start with the community town hall virtual event that's happening tonight yes tonight at five o'clock um, the community is welcome to join our president and CEO dr. Gary Weitzman for a community town hall at five o'clock and learn about learn more about San Diego Humane Society uh, what we've been up to this past year during um, COVID-19 modified operation, but also what's ahead in the future. So we're really hoping that the community tunes in. Um, you can learn more and sign up at schumane.org slash community town, town hall. It should be a good, uh, a good event this evening. Yeah, and that's another reason why people should tune in because you're having that virtual walk for animals that really does benefit the San Diego Humane Society. Yes, the virtual walk for animals. We're in the final week right now, um, and we're hoping to fundraise $400,000 for the 50,000 animals that San Diego Humane Society cares for each year. So we're really hoping the community will step up and support us in this final week. All right, it is the final week, so I know that goal that you're trying to reach is really important for the San Diego Humane Society. But also, you have some <laughs> adorable puppies that you guys just brought in, and you're looking for some names. How yes. can people name them? There's a lot going on at San Diego Humane Society right now. Uh, last month, our humane officers rescued a mother dog who had just given birth to nine puppies. They're Rhodesian Ridgeback Hound Mixes, adorable. And we thought it would be a good idea to have the community chime in and, and let us know what they think that their name should be. So um, you have until April 18th to help us name the puppies. Just go to sdhumane.org slash puppies and fill out your suggestions. It should be fun. Well, looking at those, the <laughs> pictures of those dogs, you, they just make your heart happy. They are so adorable. How old are they and when will they be available for adoption? They're about three weeks old right now and uh, they'll be available for adoption sometime late May, around May 20, maybe a little bit later when they're at least eight weeks old. They need to be spayed and neutered and vaccinated and then our medical team will also make sure that they're healthy and okay. But right now, so far so good. They're in a very great foster home. This past weekend they were yeah. outside on the grass for the first time, they're just adorable. Well, I'm making a best friend over here. <laughs> Chaco and I are Talk about Chaco because he is such a good, well-trained dog. He's and so good, yes. He's about five years old. He came in as a stray. We don't know much about his past, but this Can past week he went uh, with our volunteer team on a canine adventure to Liberty Station. He was great. He loved other dogs that he saw and, as you can tell, loves people. High energy, though, so he'll need a family who will, you know, meet those needs and take him out for walks and exercise and play with him. But he really knows how to calm down as well. So he's about five years old, a Sharpe mix. He's, he's just precious. Well, thank you so much for having us out here this morning, Nina. Thank and you for Chaco, coming. thank you for being a good boy for all of us. Paul will go ahead and send things back over to you. Can you sit for Paul? Oh, oh boy, you can no. stand. Oh, we're giving you hugs now. Yes, I suspect there'll be, the phones will be dialing up and uh, ringing very soon for Chaco. I hope uh, he finds a home this week, in fact. Wow, what a cool dog.